everyone. Welcome to the podcast. Your mindset is a bunch of convictions that shape how you view the world and yourself. It has an impact on how you think, feel, and act in any given circumstance. This indicates that your success or failure is influenced by your self-perceptions. Carol Dweck, a Stanford psychologist, says that your beliefs have a big impact on what you want and whether or not you can get it. She also says that your mindset has a big impact on success and achievement. A person's mindset can impact how individuals act in a great many circumstances throughout everyday life. For instance, when people are in various situations, their minds set off a particular mindset, which has a direct impact on how they act in those situations. According to Dweck, there are two fundamental mindsets, growth and fixed. You believe that your abilities are fixed traits that cannot be changed if you have a fixed mindset. You may also be of the opinion that success can be achieved without effort because of your talent and intelligence alone. On the other side, assuming you have a growth mindset, you accept that your talents and intelligence can be created over the long run through exertion and perseverance. This way of thinking doesn't necessarily mean that everyone can just try and become Mozart or Einstein. However, they do hold the belief that with effort, anyone can become smarter and more talented. Findings from research into the benefits of growth mindset have been well received. Knowing that the view you adopt for yourself profoundly affects the way you lead your life means we all have the potential for change. We must recognize our environment's fixed mindset triggers that hinder us in order to enter or remain in the growth zone. It could be anxiety over competence or fear of failure. When we perceive what causes us to feel protective or undermined, we can challenge and try to overcome it. People with a growth mindset are of the opinion that with the right opportunities, effort, and self-belief, we can become smarter. People who have more fixed mindset believe that you can learn new skills, like how to fix a car or ride a bike, for example, but believe that you can't train yourself or gain talent. A setback can be devastating for someone with a fixed mindset because they believe they don't have what it takes, whereas a growth-minded person sees it as an opportunity to improve and learn. When it comes to overcoming obstacles in life, your mindset plays a crucial role. A child with a growth mindset is more likely to want to learn new things and work hard to learn new things. This frequently results in academic success. As adults, these same people are more likely to persist in the face of setbacks. Instead of giving up, adults with a growth mindset view it as a chance to learn and grow. On the other hand, those with fixed mindsets are more likely to give up in the face of difficult circumstances. In her book, Dweck writes that people with fixed mindsets constantly seek validation to demonstrate their worth to themselves as well as others. How can a fixed mindset be changed? Dweck suggests that people have the ability to alter their mindsets despite the fact that those with a fixed mindset might disagree. Here's how you do it. Concentrate on the journey. A significant component while building a growth mindset is seeing the worth in your journey. You miss out on all lessons you could be learning along the way if you focus solely on your outcome. Start using the word yet, Y-E-T. Assuming you're battling with a task, advise yourself that you simply haven't dominated it yet. By including the word yet in your vocabulary, you demonstrate that you are capable of overcoming any obstacle. Focus on your words and contemplations. To develop a growth mindset, replace negative thoughts with more positive ones. Take on obstacles. Making mistakes is one of the best ways to learn. Thus, rather than avoiding difficulties, embrace them. Recognizing that we are capable of altering who we are, what we know, and how we think is part of having a growth mindset. Our own characteristics and capabilities are not static. They continue to be open to internal and external change. 
For some, this might offer a critical change in their viewpoint of what their identity is and how it can be changed. When we acknowledge our capacity for growth and development, we take responsibility for our growth and development. 